students today is our topic is multiples so children see 3 multiply by 1 is equal to 3 3 multiply by 2 is equal to 6 3 multiply by 3 is equal to 9 3 multiply by 4 is equal to 12 3 multiply by 5 is equal to 15 so children look carefully 3 is multiplied by 1 2 3 4 5 and these are the product of 3 so these are the multiple multiples of 3 like that multiples of 5 is Five is five, ten, fifteen, and so on. Six, six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-four, and so on. So three multiplied by one is three. Three multiplied by two is six. Three multiplied by three is nine. Three multiplied by four is twelve. And three multiply by five is fifty. So these are the multiples of three. And here, multiples of five is five, ten, fifty, etc. And multiples of six is six, twelve, eighteen, etc. Suppose the question asks that find the first multiples of three or four multiples of Two. How can we do? Question asked that find four multiples of two. How can we do? First, write two, and after that, two multiply by one is equal to two. Two multiply by two is equal to four. Two multiply by three is equal to Six to multiply by four is equal to eight. So up to four, we multiply two and get the four multiples of two. The same question: find out the multiples of seven. Five multiples. How can we write up to five? Seven, fourteen, twenty-one, twenty-eight, thirty-five. Up to place of five. So here five multiples of seven. Okay. Now, today I am going to start chapter six point two from your textbook. Look carefully. So, children, before starting the chapter, I am going to explain about properties of multiples. So, simply here is two properties. First, we first one is when a number multiplied by one. we get the same number for example 11 multiply by 1 what we get 11 12 or 90 multiply by 1 then 90 the second property is multiples of any numbers if we say like that four multiples then 4 8 12 16 etc 6 6 12 80 24 so only two properties of multiples okay now i am going to start exercise 6.2 look carefully in your book question number 1 is write true or false for the following statements Five is a multiple of nine. So how can you check? See in exercise six point two. See question number A. Five is multiples of nine. You know table of nine and you get forty five. But for this sum you find out you multiply forty five by nine. If nine In nine table five ten forty five, 
so fully divided so it is correct or true like that you will do question number 1 so see question number 2 write the next four multiples i am taking question number b see write four multiples 15 30 45 given after that four place you will write the table of 15 how 60 75 90 and 105 so question number 3 answer the following questions it is very simple and easy children i am taking question number a is 81 a multiple of 9 yes or no but you saw the method how it is yes then you will write like this 9 multiply by 9 is equal to 81 so it is multiple of 9 okay it's 168 is multiples of 21 yes then how yes so you multiply you divide 168 by 21 see how can you divide 8 times 1 is 8 2 is 16 so fully divided then the answer is yes okay so by seeing these two sum you can do question number 3 and whom class work for you question number 1 2 and 3 okay thank you